Good morning, dear students. Today we will learn to draw notes and coins of smaller value in place of ones with greater. So, let's start. So, kids, what do you see here? Yes, it is a hundred rupee note. We have to draw those notes and coins which are equal to the value of hundred rupee note. Students, we can draw different types of notes instead of hundred rupee note. Students, see here we have drawn different types of notes for hundred rupee. Here, in place of hundred rupee, we have drawn two notes of rupees fifty. If we draw ten notes of rupees ten, then also their value will be equal to rupees hundred. Here we have drawn one note of rupees fifty, one note of rupees ten, and two notes of rupees twenty. Students, we can also draw five notes of rupees twenty in place of rupees hundred. Students, here I will draw notes of rupees fifty in place of rupees hundred. Students, this is our first note of rupees fifty. Students, let's draw one more note of rupees fifty. So, kids, together these two notes of rupees fifty is equal to the value of rupees hundred. You can also draw notes of your choice to replace rupees hundred. In the same way, we can also draw different notes and coins in place of rupees fifty. See, students, here we have drawn one note of rupees twenty and three coins of rupees ten. And here we have drawn five notes of rupees ten for rupees fifty. In place of fifty rupees, we can also draw one note of rupees twenty, one note of rupees ten, and four coins of rupees five. Students, here we drawn two notes of rupees twenty and one note of rupees ten in place of rupees fifty. So, students, let's try to draw some notes for rupees fifty. First of all, we will draw one note of rupees twenty. Then we will draw one note of rupees ten. See, students, we have drawn one more note of rupees ten. Now we will draw one more note of rupees ten, so that their value is equal to rupees fifty. See, students, this is twenty rupees, thirty rupees, forty rupees, and fifty rupees. In the same way, we can also draw different notes and coins for rupees twenty. Here we have drawn two notes of rupees ten in place of rupees twenty. Two notes of rupees five and five coins of rupees two together are also equal to the value of rupees twenty. Students, you can also draw four coins of rupees five for rupees twenty. If we draw one note of rupees ten and two coins of rupees five, they will be also equal to rupees twenty. So, students, let's try to draw some notes and coins in place of rupees twenty. We will draw five rupees coins. This is our first five rupee coin. Now we will draw one more coin of rupees five. One more coin of rupees five. Now we draw one more coin of rupees five, so that their value will be equal to rupees twenty. This is five rupees, ten rupees, fifteen rupees, and twenty rupees. Students, today we have learned that how we can draw different notes and coins of smaller value in place of large ones. Today's past question is: Choose the correct option equal to value of rupees hundred. Students, option A has two notes of rupees twenty. Option B has one note of rupees fifty and one note of rupees ten. And option C has two notes of rupees fifty. Option D has one note of rupees twenty, one coin of rupees five, and one coin of rupees ten.
students here in the option c the value of two notes of rupees 50 is equal to the value of rupees 100 so our answer is option c now it's time for your homework it is six sum at page number 106 Convert the greater value currency notes and coins into smaller value coins and notes. Thank you. Have a nice day.